assalamu alaikum today we will discuss what is the boroscopy in pharmaceutical industries many of you are not familiar with the term boroscopy so in this video you will learn what is the boroscopy which instrument is used for boroscopy what are the components of instrument used for boroscopy and what are the types of instrument used for boroscopy what are the advantages of boroscopy and how we perform boroscopy so let's start what is the boroscopy boroscopy is basically non destructive visual inspection technique which is used to inspect internal surfaces of any stainless steel transfer lines or pipes or equipments without dismantling or opening the parts of transfer lines or equipments in detail or in precise definition boroscopy is a technique where we take high resolution images and videos for inspection of internal surfaces of stainless steel pipes transfer lines clean in place lines or any equipment parts to observe its internal surfaces for any defect like erosion corrosion or contaminants and these defects are difficult to observe with naked eye so i hope you are now familiar with boroscopy mean a simple technique used to observe internal parts of any pipe or equipment to observe it internal surface so which instrument is used for boroscopy the name of instrument used for boroscopy is boroscope b o r e s c o p e so many people write it as boroscope but it is boroscope now what is the boroscope components of boroscope it is a very simple equipment and it has four components one is the working length other is the light source optic system and display working length is the main component of the boroscope it may be a rigid or flexible component and it is the part which is inserted inside the hole to observe the surfaces next one is the light source light source is used to illuminate the internal surfaces to take better images and record videos next one is the optic system an optic system is also installed in the boroscope and it may be relay lenses road lenses fiber optic image system or camera you can say that it is the eye of boroscope next one is the display any medium by which we observe or watch the video or images types of boroscope basically there are three types of boroscope one is the rigid boroscope second one is flexible boroscope and video boroscope rigid boroscope rigid boroscope has a rigid working length and it is used at those places we have need straight insertion in this rigid boroscope image is taken up by the lens and sent to the relay system and this image is observed by the eyepiece next one is the flexible boroscope flexible boroscope is also known as fiber scope in this fiber scope image is taken up by the lens and sent to the relay system by fiber optic system next one is the here eyepiece is also installed and we have a option to connect eyepiece with the monitor to observe the images on large screen next one is the video boroscope video boroscope or videoscopy it look like the fiber scope or flexible boroscope but the main difference is that here we have installed a camera and we can record video along with the images so it was all about the types of boroscope so it was all about the types of boroscope now why boroscopy mean why we need boroscopy we need boroscopy for the inspection of internal surfaces to observe any surface defects erosion or corrosion 
and we use boroscopy to find out that is there any blisters on the internal internal surface is there any cracks on the internal surface is there any peeling on the internal surface boroscopy is used to inspect the quality of welding joints which is one of the most important application of boroscopy how boroscopy is performed for to perform boroscopy usually it is performed for stainless steel transfer lines or loop circulation system we know that many welding joints are available in transfer lines or loop circulation system so each and every joint is examined with the boroscope to inspect its quality boroscope performance is also the requirement of many regulatory bodies we have to provide the documents for the welding joints of our transfer lines and pipes how to perform boroscopy to perform boroscopy simply we insert the working length of boroscope inside the hole and we take the 360 view of internal surfaces we simply inspect all the length of the pipe and we observe each joint with great care to see any defect or any crack of the joint one of the best thing for boroscopy is that we can save the images with the text mean we can give a special id to our each and every joint and if any welding joint is found defective we can mark it as defective and later on we will retest it after rectification all the images and videos of transfer lines are stored in a folder with the location and name of the lines for easy identification so it was all about the boroscopy if you like the video share it to others until the next video allah hafiz